I look forward to hearing what the submissions submitters actually say when this uh, piece of legislation wins its way. I won't um, say a great deal about the gift duty portion. Colleagues of mine have canvassed, uh, traversed that field, other than to say, sir, there will inevitably be a debate as to whether or not the removal of this gift duty obligation uh, improves or worsens the situation in terms of people's entitlement to various social benefits. Uh, today, sir, we had a report put forward by Diane Crossan where she was warning parliamentarians about essentially the burden of our ageing population and the welfare cost associated with the changing nature of our population. So I, I want to acknowledge part of the contribution that came from uh, Minister Dunn. Without a doubt, there are very large challenges before us as a country and as an assembly as to what's the balance? How do we raise our revenue? And in what way do we dedicate revenue to those who need it? And at what point should their need be assessed? So, sir, in, in, in one small respect, he is raising, uh, he says, uh, a remedy to that, but that is uh, an innovation that we won't be agreeing with, sir. But I want, to, I want to just talk about something that did concern a number of us, sir, uh, at the Select Committee when we received an earlier briefing about some of the changes that the IRD officials were looking at. And I must say the IRD officials were very helpful in outlining some of their thinking and the responses that were coming to us from the public. And, sir, one of the concerns, and I'm glad the Minister is in the House, is whether or not the state agency, the IRD, ought to be simplifying the transfer of information to private credit agencies. Now, sir, I can understand and um, fully uh, support the opportunity for the public to come and tell us what they think in relation to the sharing of data and information between state agencies. And given that we're in the business of improving efficiency and trying to lessen administrative burden, uh, that I can get my head around, sir. But the next step as to whether or not people who either owe debt or are endeavouring to pay back debt, negotiate the final quantum, etc., with other state agencies, ought that information to be disclosed if it involves child support and student debts to private credit agencies. Now, I, I, sir, I, I do digress slightly, but it is an issue that does impact on the administration, the efficiency and the integrity of the information that the IRD keeps about us as citizens. So this bill, sir, does not include those provisions, but I've no doubt uh, through you, sir, to the Minister, that um, this will remain a live issue. And it's as much a privacy justice issue as it is uh, a tax administration issue, but it's something that bothers me considerably. Sir, the new framework for sharing IRD information, providing that the manner in which that information is being exchanged or provided is shared at the same time with the citizen that it pertains to. Now, there may be some circumstances where investigations are underway, privacy in terms of what information can be revealed to the person who is suffering the uh, not inconsiderable powers of the state to uh, investigate their affairs. There may be some cases there, but I think, sir, that the best way if this is ever to work, and I look forward to hearing what the submitters have to say, is to ensure that the citizen concerned isn't overwhelmed or feel that they're in some sort of Orwellian experience. So in relation to the deeper question as to whether or not there were other changes that could have been made, our side of the House, sir, has recited, some might say ad nauseum, but we've recited the reasons as to why we did not agree with the distribution of winners and losers in the recent tax changes. I think, sir, given that $250 million a week, we're told, is being borrowed by the state, that once you shrink 
the Crown's revenue, sir, you can only get revenue from one of two other sources. You can get it either by raising it through debt or, sir, you can get it by shrinking and I would say savaging your cost structure so that rather than put your revenue up, which would be to restore some of the, uh, uh, some of the taxes that uh, have been lessened, you're left with the problem that the government currently has, sir. So, no, we didn't agree, and we won't be agreeing, sir, that the uh, recent tax, tax changes have actually enriched the country. That's a key ideological point that defines the different approaches between the, the uh, two parties. So we heard from the leader, uh, the co-leader, of the Green Party uh, about uh, his enthusiasm for a capital gains tax. Well, earlier this year, sir, the tax working group out of Victoria University did not embrace a capital gains tax model. And uh, it's certainly not something on this side of the House, sir, that we've been trumpeting loudly or are racing forward as a key feature to the tax change. But, sir, what this bill is showing us is that if we continue to treat the tax system so that it rewards only a narrow category of people and worsens the burden of the majority, don't for a moment think, sir, that that narrow category of taxpayer, as a consequence of having more dough at their disposal, is somehow going to act as a new agent of dynamism to unleash economic growth, represents a new threshold for investment, new firms, new jobs, etc. That is something, sir, which probably lies behind, in terms of what my colleagues are saying, of why we won't be agreeing with the changes to the gift duty. And yes, I did hear what um, the member from the South Island, Amy Adams, had to say that, and she uh, told us how, I presume she was telling us, as a consequence of her unsurpassed knowledge of being an accountant, how easy it is to circumvent the current rules, etc. Well, I, 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 oh, sorry, sir, a lawyer. Well, I, I kind of feel, sir, that the uh, that, 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 that she needs to change the tune on, in terms of how she addresses the select committee, because she's left us with the impression of not only being a uh, highly qualified legal beagle, but also a uh, very skilled accountant. Now, that may be the case, but that does not necessarily, sir, lead, to be, lead, 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 lead her colleagues to conclude that she's a fine parliamentarian. In fact, sir, I think Hekia Palata is a fine parliamentarian. And I've yet to enjoy the opportunity to acknowledge, sir, that uh, she has ascended the ranks. She now occupies uh, a position, possibly the most junior position, but it's quite a lofty, lofty spot to occupy. I, too, was once there. So, uh, sir, uh, on, uh, along with my colleague, Parekura Horomia, I want to congratulate her. <laughs> uh, I, I've had slightly different positions this year, and I'll be enough from Ngāti Wahine at the back, sir. I, I might have to call on your support. But, sir, the, uh, I, I do want to acknowledge the contribution that Hekia Parata uh, has made and look forward to hearing more of her in the House, etc. So we won't be supporting this bill. However, we do look forward to hearing the submissions. It does make some... Uh, it lays out some important challenges. Now, Mr Dunn and I will never agree on everything, but I'd like to say one thing. He is clearly outlining the fact that revenue is brittle. And where you've got brittle revenue, you have to find innovative ways to justify not only the cost, but the purpose of running ongoing programs. And no doubt, sir, part of that will come as the submissions, and it may only be as a segue because uh, part of the debate about the gift duty was always a concern as to whether or not clever people with access to Amy Adams' unsurpassed knowledge would be enjoying an entitlement, sir, to certain services of the state that we may not feel that they deserve by dint of wealth that they putatively own but technically have handed on to another. So, sir, we do look forward to the submissions. Thank you very much.